Scotland is a country that is part of the United Kingdom. Edinburgh is the capital of Scotland. In this video, we will go through a few aspects of Edinburgh Castle. The recipe we will cover today is ground lamb fry. Edinburgh Castle is one of the oldest castles in Europe. It is built on a rock. As you climb up to reach the castle, there are a few statues and plaques that commemorate the history of the castle. At the entrance of the castle, there are two statues. The statues belong to Robert the Bruce and William Wallace, two of the heroes of Scotland. The castle has many buildings and they were used for various purposes. One of the palaces in the castle was used by Mary, Queen of Scots. Her son, James, became the King of Scotland and the King of England. The crown jewels of Scotland are housed in this castle. You can walk around before getting to the location where the crown jewels can be viewed. This is where the crown jewels are stored. You can see the crown, the scepter and the sword. Then we get to Queen Mary's chamber where she gave birth to James, who became the King of Scotland and the King of England. You can walk on the ramparts of the castle where cannons were placed to protect the castle. The views are beautiful.
Scotland raises a lot of sheep. There are a lot of articles uh, made out of wool and uh, there are a lot of lamb dishes here. I give a recipe for ground lamb fry. The ingredients listed here are for three pounds of ground lamb. I strain the ground lamb before using it in the dish. Put a saucepan on the stove and add two teaspoons of oil. Then add the chopped onions and uh, saute them till they are transparent and get browned. Once the onions are browned, add the ginger garlic paste and uh, saute the mixture till you get a nice smell. Then you can add the turmeric, chili powder, salt and a garam masala and then mix everything and uh, let them cook for a few minutes. Now you can add the ground lamb and mix everything up. Make sure that there are no lumps and uh, everything is well mixed. Then you can cook it for some time with the lid on. As the dish cooks, the liquid comes out and uh, the dish cooks in the liquid. You keep uh, mixing the dish periodically and keep checking to see if the liquid is completely absorbed. Your dish is done when the liquid is completely absorbed. As you can see here, I'm checking to see that uh, the liquid is completely absorbed. And uh, when it is absorbed, the dish is done. You can serve it with rice and uh, enjoy your meal. If you like this video, please subscribe and you can also provide comments.